All right, hello everyone. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. So glad to have you here. I am Paula. On my channel, I share all things budgeting as well as some additional things. This is going to be um, a savings challenge video, kind of an unexpected savings challenge video, but a savings challenge video nonetheless. But first, I have some happy mail that I'm going to share <clears throat> and pull out here. I've already like ripped it open because that's just how I roll. This is from um, <clears throat> Mandy. Um, over at Mandy's Budgeting Items. Um, she's Mandy's Budgeting Journey here on YouTube and on Instagram and Mandy's Budgeting Items on Etsy. Um, so first, there is a card here. Oh, with a sweet note. Yes, Mandy, I love uh, fall and the changing leaves. It is my favorite season. Um, we're in Iowa, so we all kinds of experience it. We are getting ready to harvest our crops and get in the field. Fall is my favorite. So she sent out some happy mail. We have some stickers. These are cute. Um, a mystery scratcher. <clears throat> and three savings challenges. So this will be really exciting to do in October with kind of the ghost there. Ooh, the fall leaves. And a little gnome. So cute. Okay. Gosh, thank you so much, Mandy. Um, for any of you who've watched any of my savings challenge videos, the Pink Cows, that is a digital product in her shop. She is the one that I got those from. So we're just going to go ahead and ignore um, the wonderful color on my table today. That is uh, thanks to... I was gone the last two days and my husband was kind enough to let my kids color with like my big bag of highlighters and markers and that is personal <clears throat> permanent marker that has come through the paper onto the table. So it's all right though. Nobody's mad about it. <clears throat> but all right, so let's jump in. Um, so today we have some rollover as well as I really just need to move the brown one. It just doesn't stay up. Like I just need to, to quit trying. Okay. Um, okay. So our savings challenge money today is some rollover and then some money from sales of eggs from our chickens. So I do try to budget some um, money for savings challenges when we get paid, um, like sinking fund specific ones, but otherwise... It's like bonus money that I wasn't expecting as well as um, uh, otherwise it's bonus money that I wasn't expecting and uh, rollover money. So we're just going to jump into this right now. All right, we're going to start by counting the money. We have 20, 30. 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 48. So we are going to start in here. As everybody here knows that, whoopsie. I'm really trying to get this one done so I feel like this category is fully funded. Um, Tracy from Golden Girl Budgets is where the savings challenge is from. Fifteen. And five. I was going to say I thought there was $20 left based on um, what the total is for this scratcher. So those are the last two excited to finally get that done. So that is $20 total, which means for this savings challenge, we have saved, um, 100. That was the total, but all together in my boots, um, envelope, I have 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 200 dollars. I'm going to put those ones in and exchange. <clears throat> and I'm going to put these two fives in and exchange them for the ten. So we've just kind of got, it's not like totally condensed or anything, but we've got a little bit smaller amounts in there for that right now. Um, 
Then I think I'm going to hop over into <clears throat> since this isn't a specific, I have this amount of money budgeted for these things. I'm going to pop over here to some of the mystery ones. This pumpkin lover, I did a bunch of these on a previous video. This was a freebie from um, Life with Bobby. And then I also have a little bonus um, savings scratcher that I got from Marlene um, at Snow Gardener 307. <clears throat> and I just took the money from both of the, from this and another freebie that I had, and I just put it in the save envelope. It's just kind of extra. I'll allocate it when I get done with some of these extras. So I have 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. For anyone who is paying attention, I did have an IOU of a dollar, but I found a dollar, and the total of the last time I counted this envelope on that video was 24, and there is now 25 in there. So that's me being as honest as possible. Um with myself and with y'all. Okay, so I'm gonna start with what we have left on the Pumpkin Lover Challenge here. Ooh, six. Whew, this is gonna add up quickly. <laughs> and nine. Six and nine is 15. Right? Six and nine, I read those, yeah, I read those correctly. Okay, so we have 15 going into the save envelope. Five, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. So I'll just put that down there and this adorable guy, again, Life with Bobby is where I got this, where I, I didn't, um, this was a freebie from my order with her. So I'm going to put that off to the side is one that I've completed. Since that one was 15, you've got me over here a little bit nervous about if I should even scratch these off of here. Well, let's see what we get. Okay, Marlene, what are you doing to me here? Okay. Oh, $2. Well, that's, that's doable. Okay. Sometimes you don't know. When you open a mystery one, you don't know if it's low income. You don't know what the total is. And five. Seven dollars. Awesome. Also, not too bad. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, did I put the two over there? Oh, no, I got to count. Five, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay, I put the two from the first scratcher there, so I just need the five from the second one from Marlene. Five, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, two from Marlene, five from Marlene. Okay, getting like out of hand here with myself. I guess while I'm here doing things um, and being unsure of what's happening, I might as well scratch this mystery scratcher that was the freebie from uh, or the part of my happy mail today from Mandy's budgeting items. Ooh, $3. Awesome. It's always nice when they're not super. <laughs> One, two, three. So that just leaves us with a couple dollars left. So what I'm going to do here, I'm going to, okay, so this is everything that I scratched off with the three different mystery ones that we did today, and I'm going to pop those in, add it up with the other things that we have in our completed just save envelope here that has yet to be allocated. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50. Well, that's exciting. I'm going to think on that for a second because I already have some things kind of running through my head as a few things did pop up as life does um, when one is, I don't know, an adult. Um, and I can talk a little bit more about that in a little bit. I don't have... Um, these amounts are 1 to 10. I'm a little nervous to scratch... on there, knowing that I only have $3. Let me pop into this one and see what I have. So tax prep has a has threes on it, so does kids. Um, 
I am going to actually put the three in the $200 savings challenge here um, for that we have for uh, clothes. This, oh gosh, and now I'm not even going to remember where I got the freebie. Oh, shoot. Oh my gosh, I got it from another order, but now I'm totally blanking on which order that was. Happens when you make <clears throat> significantly more orders than what's probably necessary. Okay, so I'm going to put those three in there. So it's a $200 savings challenge, but we have spent some money out of it um, since I... You know, I, I think I put 100 in when I rolled over my back-to-school envelope, and then we, we've used it a little bit. So currently in close, we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 80. So we do have 80 in clothes currently. Um... And that is the kind of, that not kind of, that is the end of the money that we have right now. <clears throat> but I am going to go in and, and the reason I put that money in clothes, I, you know, we all know that clothes are expensive. I, no, my kids, I don't like need clothes for my kids right now. I'm, I'm pretty fortunate on that end. But um, we did get an email that some, they are releasing and opening the like store at my work. Okay like branded apparel um, that has like our logo on it, t-shirts and hoodies and stuff that, that say where we work for. Um, and it allows us to, you know, wear that stuff a little bit more casually. Um, and so I wanted to grab a couple t-shirts of that. So I just want to make sure that I keep bulking up that clothes envelope um, and not being like, oh, there's $70 in there. Well, that's not going to go very far in the whole, in the whole grand scheme of, of clothes, as we know. Um, and so... This in this save that we just saved up and finished all of the mystery challenges that I had in here. It has all of those, the things that you scratch off in there. So I need to find a good like place to just keep extra challenges, but I definitely think I'm going to start this fall one here next <clears throat> when we get paid. Um, but so a couple things have come up in our life. <laughs> One is that, well, and I kind of explained this in our tracking or in my last expense check-in, um, but my husband's driver's license to get renewed was $80. I pulled $30 out of random envelopes to go back towards our buffer. So this 50 would cover the rest of that. Or um, I think it's just the kind of doorknob that we have on our door, but we've had to replace our doorknob several times on like our front screen door. Um, it's one of the ones, it's not a knob, but it's like a, a pull down handle and, and kids just opening and closing it and they're doing their best to be as gentle as possible. I really like nobody's wrenching on it, but it seems very un, in, um, very not secure right now. So my husband, um, we had previously been buying them at a local hardware store, the replacements, and they were like $80. So um, we decided to be a little bit proactive as well as, as much as we like to shop local. We were looking online and found them on Amazon, but they're really still $75. Um, I did get a $25 Amazon gift card for um, doing a review for an Amazon seller where I bought something. So I have a $25 gift card plus this $50 here would uh, cover that replacement doorknob. So I have to do some thinking, but I'm thinking this might end up being put right into my home envelope and then spent right out of it because we do have that expense currently. But you'll probably see, uh, you'll see more about my decision on that um, next time I do a check-in and I'm pulling things out for expenses, I'm sure. But so that is what I have for today for our uh, savings challenge video and some of the mystery ones that I had. So thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed it. Uh, please like this video on your way out. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. I'd be happy to answer any of those or, or chat with you about what you have going on. And if you enjoyed, um, if you enjoy budgeting content and um, a little bit of a, of a chaotic mess, then please subscribe and come on back. And until then, bye.